Look, they're still coming around the far corner there. So it's going to be tough for the ride at the back, and steadily but surely they will get weaker. And there were about 20,000 people on this course yesterday, by the way. The uh, tourists had their moment of glory, which they tried to turn into a bike race, of course, as they rode the whole course uh, on their bikes for fun. And uh, it was a lovely day, and it gets more and more popular every year. The, the randonnée, as they call it here, the route of the Tour of Flanders. Now another serious attack coming off the front. Well, this is the other Belgian team, the team that uh, was uh, part of the quickstep de Vitamont team that on the front there was the the team that Nico Matin rides for and they're certainly trying to whip it up you can see the time gap is starting to to slip down just a little bit as we head up towards the Grotenberg for the main field just onto the slopes now short and sharp but they do hurt believe me because the riders hit them so fast on these climbs relaxed body soul team of uh, Nico Matin Quite a few new teams on the block this year, and even some of the old teams have changed their colours just to fool us, but we're doing okay at the moment. This man on the front left hand side here is uh, Servais Canavan, a former Dutch national champion, a winner of a stage in the Tour de France, and that was in Bordeaux after a very good move. He today has been sent to the front by the team to whip up the pacemaking. He's looking over his shoulder all the time because he doesn't want to create a, a difficulty for his team leaders. We've got a chance here to see on the left-hand side here the Kop van der Weeks right, the front end of the bike race, which is still 26 men strong. But I have a feeling they, they seem to be losing their impetus as they head out towards the difficult section. There's Tony Cruz there looking very comfortable in this group. He won't work too hard in this leading breakaway of 26 because his orders, I would say, are to just be there and be present in case this breakaway does survive. That's right and uh, his job is just to be there just in case things go a little pear-shaped towards the end and they've got a man up in that breakaway.